What's up people, welcome to our channel. So in wrestling mix matches, typically refer to matches where male and female wrestlers compete against each other, as, as we see right now in front of eyes. Historically, these types of matches have been less common due to various factors, including concerns about physicality, differences and the portrayal of violence against women. However, they have become more prevalent in certain wrestling promotions, especially in recent years with a growing emphasis on gender equality and diversity. And if we talk about gender equality, then we see here that women are dominating. So then uh, we talk about intergender matches, right? These are matches where male and female wrestlers face off against each other in a standard one-on-one -on -one or tag team or multi-person match. The rules and stipulations of these matches typically follow those of traditional wrestling matches. And this girl is, is actually mocking her opponent. You cannot do anything. Probably the purpose of this competition is that supporters of intergender wrestling argue that it promotes equality and showcases the skills and athleticism of all wrestlers, regardless of gender. Of course, promotion is made um, by themselves somewhere on backyard, but anyway. It's uh, entertaining to watch. In recent years, some wrestling promotions have embraced intergender wrestling as a way to push boundaries, tell compelling stories, and provide opportunities for female wrestlers to compete on equal footing with their male counterparts. These matches often involve innovative storytelling and great but for entertaining purposes, of course, it's better to um, um, to call two opponents. Woman is uh, highly trained, and a man is not trained at all, or he is uh, uh, less uh, less fit. So then we have here interesting situation when woman actually wins. And look at the spectators. <laughs> they uh, they sitting like they are meditating. Anyway, uh, friends, what do you think about such uh, competitions? Okay, she can live. Okay, see you later.